Good morning, everybody. It's Facebook Friday. How's everybody doing today? Let me just adjust this a little bit. So how's everybody doing? Well, it's Friday. Thank goodness, right? Uh, today, I'm going to show you some new products. And then I'm going to tell you, check back with me on Sunday. And I'm going to show you some samples and some stamping with all the new products. Okay, so who's with me? I know I might be a minute early. Um, but I wanted to get, a, I got a lot of things to, to talk to you about. So first thing I wanted to show you was something pretty, pretty cute. Um, this is my catalog. As you can see, it's well used. Okay. And you see these little tabs here? You're not going to see me today. You're just going to be seeing the, the videos. Okay. So the little tabs, and I have these categorized by hearts, which I love. Little cart which I'm ordering next. And what I do is it's our tabs for everything and our tab punch. I make these little tabs and the great thing is I'm using scraps to make those. You can get really fancy because they have little circles and, and cute little doodads in here. But uh, I kept mine kind of simple right now. So what I did was I just made some tabs and as I go through the catalog, the stuff you're going to see is the first wave of I have to have it. The little carts here are my next group of items that I want. That And then the hearts are I love it but I can wait a little while. And then as I order them I pull the tabs off and I just put more tabs on them. Okay so that's something I just wanted to show you that's pretty cute to um, hi, Ka hi Carrie how are you this morning? Um, so I put those on there just to for me to keep track because I have ordered. Hi, Diana. How are you? Yes, please stop by. Say hi and tell me where you're from. I've re I've ordered doubles of things. I know there's plenty of you out there that have done that. So this is a, a way I keep track of what I'm ordering. Again, it's our tabs for everything and our tab punch. Okay, and then again, you make the tabs using some of the scrap um, or retired DSP. Okay, so the next thing I wanted to show you, so this box, and I already opened the box, sorry, um, it was kind of mangled from UPS, already called Stampin' Up, they're so great, I love Stampin' Up. Um, so one of the things I wanted to show you, and I'll bring that in, I'm not going to go over the stuff that we've already seen, except for the animal outing. Okay, animal outing, you've seen that. I've showed you that. We've done, hi Stacy. good morning. We've done, yes, please share my video, whether you share it now or you share it later, and I'll tell you why at the end of the video, okay? Or somewhere in between. So animal outing, I was able to get that at, uh, um, on stage. And what I didn't have for that and I showed, I've done videos on that and samples. So the reason I'm showing you this is because I was able to order the Animal Friends Thinlets, which were, just became available to us also on June 1st. Okay. And then the other thing is, which we're going to open right now, drum roll, love it, is the Animal Expedition Paper. This is one of those sets, and I've said it before, that I was, I probably wouldn't have ordered, but I got it at, on stage, and I am so happy I did, because it is one of my favorite sets. So here is the paper, and seeing it in the catalog and seeing it live right here makes a big difference. Again, there's 12 sheets in here, and um, there's, it's two-sided, okay? So this is the first one, and then that's the other side. Okay, so I'm just going to slide those over. I'm going to go through this a little, or I'm sorry, there's four of these, or three of these. <laughs> See, it's too early for me. This is another one, and this is the other side. Now, this is all part of my paper share, and if you're interested in my paper share, the first group is already filled up, but I am doing a second one. Just email me. Go to stampersdelight.com, and I can get you all the information on the paper share. So that's the second piece there. Here's another one. So stinking cute. That's the other side. There's another one. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Can you see that? 
adorable. That's the other side there. And then the last one. Some little gators. And the other side. So even though I, I'm, I'm showing you this one because... I just got the paper and the thinlets to go with that stamp set. So what I'll be doing is showing you, um, this is the second round. I did get a pre-order. We already went through that. Um, so this is the second set of items I've received. And I'll be working on um, some samples with this over the weekend. So stay tuned for that. The next item I wanted to show you is the bouquet blooms. Okay, so I've got that set. And that also has um, the gatefold blossom framelits. Now, this is a bundle. So right now in the new catalog, you can save 10% if you do it as the bundle. You know how that works. This, this catalog, it's a bundle. Next catalog next year, it will be separates. So, so I am going to see how many uh, samples I can do over the weekend and get back to you on Sunday night at 7 p.m., another Facebook Live with samples from whatever I can do because I'm also going to be getting ready for my next class, which is June 12th. So that's Tuesday night, so I'm going to be doing a little bit of everything this weekend. But I will be back on Facebook Live 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time Sunday with some stamping and some samples. So that's the Bouquet Blooms. Then we have the Botanical Bliss. Again, that's a bundle, and that's got some tags. I can't wait to do this one. I love this one. This is also in the new catalog. If you need the new catalog, again, contact me. I can get you out a free catalog. And if you're one of my customers already, you've, uh, it's on its way. If you haven't received it, let me know. Okay. With that, I'm going to show you some more 6x6 uh, six six paper, which is also in, this is Garden Impressions. This was available to us earlier, but I hadn't received it, so... Let me just show you some of this. This is 6x6. Six six. The other one is 12x12. 12 12. Again, this is double-sided. So here's some really great, great designer series paper. And the reason I matched it up with Botanical Bliss is it, it really goes with just about everything. Okay, let's see what this one is. Again, this is going to be in the uh, paper share. This does this one I thought I and this is why I put the tags like I said I put those little, little whoops, sorry about that I put these little tags on everything because this is something I thought I wanted this set so bad and then I didn't have it marked with the tab so I thought I forgot to order it this set is adorable wonderful moments and I wish I'd gotten it a little bit sooner because I just had a baby shower and this would have been perfect no no worries got a few more coming up this uh, this summer wedding and baby showers. That's wonderful moments. And that's a, it's got a double set in there. So this is this is a big set. Okay. Gorgeous. Gorgeous set. Uh, let's see what else we have. We did the animal outing, so I'm going to put that over there. We got some more paper. This is the best route. Let's open that. And I didn't get the... This is a suite. So the great thing about the Stampin' Up! catalog is if you go to the pages where the stamp sets are, and they say sweets on them, it actually gives you everything you need to coordinate. The stamp set, which I didn't get on this one yet. Okay, I needed the designer series paper for the paper share. Um, so the, the stamp set that goes with it is in my next batch. Okay, but here's some designer series paper. This is going to be good for me, too, because I just got back from vacation. And this is going to be great with the uh, memories and more cards that go with it so that I can uh, scrapbook my trip. Okay, so there's some more. And, oh, there's little bicycles there. That's great because I took a great picture of a bicycle in Sicily. There's a little bicycle, some little airplanes. And, yes, I was on several airplanes. And then we have these two. more. Oh my god, this is great. You know what's going to happen now? The thing that happens every Friday morning when I do this, I don't want to go to work. I just want to stamp. And we have some little embellishments that go with that. It's 
Oh, I can't wait to see what I... I can't wait myself to see what I do this weekend. And then we have Broadway Bound. Now, this is really cool. Let me tell you why. Because this paper and the stamp set that goes with it coordinates with June's My Paper Pumpkin. We don't know what My Paper Pumpkin is this month, but we do know that it coordinates with the Broadway Bound. Okay, so if you aren't a paper, My Paper Pumpkin, um, that's easy for me people to say my paper pumpkin subscriber contact me there too it's not too late to get your june kit you have till june 10th and you'll be able to get in on that as long as it's uh not sold out so here's the paper on that and i don't know if you can see it but it's shimmers anything that shimmers and glitters i love let's see what's on the back side of that okay Ooh, some more that's gonna make some beautiful cards and the back side of that one. We got some more here. Whew. It's going to be a fun weekend. Uh, no sleep this weekend. Oh, here we have some birthdays. Got a little more shimmery paper. Let's see what's on the back side of that one. So I haven't looked at these either. I mean, other than in the catalog. So you're, we're being the first here together. Oh, this is going to make some great cards. And then we have the candles. And we also have some little candle embellishments, which is on my next batch to order. Um, everybody always asks me if I order everything in the catalog. Not at first. Um, I do it, you know, must have, like I said, I do the first thing is got to have next in line. Love it, but can wait. And as a demonstrator, I, you know, I get the first sneak peeks on everything. So that's pretty cool. And um, I take my time in ordering. So, if you're interested in being a demonstrator and getting a discount or doing this as um, a side job or a full-time job, I, I have a full-time job. I do this as a part-time job, but this is what I call my fun job. Okay, so this one is Little Twinkle. This stamp set has not only the stamp set, a matching punch. Hi, Jean. How are you this morning? This has a matching punch. It also has some little self-adhesive, can you see those? Stars, how cute, different colors. I haven't opened those up, let's open them up real quick. I know we gotta get to, we gotta get to work here. Again, stay tuned to see how you can win something free. Enter in my drawing, okay. Oh, of course I got them, there we go. Okay, let's see. So they're the hologram type, the little holograms. Oh my goodness. Yeah, no sleep this weekend. Okay, so let's put that aside. And also with that, we have some designer series paper that matches that. Twinkle, twinkle. Can, can some of you out there have some more babies so I can have lots more baby cards to make? <laughs> not me, not me. Okay, so here we have this one. And on the flip side of that, whoops, flip side of that one, is that, oh, I love the little twinkle one. And the next one, which is really cute, too, is the stars. Now, these don't have to be, obviously, used with the baby cards. I mix and match everything. And here's some more paper. Again, this is all in my designer series product share. And this one, I know I'm kind of rushing through this, sorry. But again, don't forget to check back with me on Sunday night at 7 o'clock, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, so I can show you what I've done with, I, I challenge myself all the time. See if I can get, good morning Maureen, thanks for tuning in. I challenge myself to see how many of the new sets I can get samples made of. I always say, oh, I'm going to do one of everything. I try. I try. So that's the twinkle. Twinkle, twinkle. So since I did the twinkle, twinkle, let's stay on the babies. Okay? Uh, this one is Little Elephant. Now, we had Little Elephants before. The thing I love about this is it's got the matching punch. So that paper can also be used for this, obviously. 
I did a shower a few years ago for my niece, and she had the little elephants. The other one that, that can tie into, but it's not just for babies, is Best Bunny. Because you could use the bunny, obviously, for showers. But if you see, this this is really a general one. It's got welcome, little one, happy birthday, hopping by. You made my day. So it's it's a general stamp set, but you can use it with the baby paper. And it also has the matching punch. Okay, that's another one. And let's see. Next suite is beautiful promenade. This, I, I can't wait to use this one either. I know I say that about everything. That has the matching thinlets, beautiful layers. It also has some matching uh, petal pink rhinestones. Anybody that knows me knows I love my rhinestones. Don't forget to share my video and I'll tell you why at the end of this one. Okay, and that also has the matching paper. And if you have... If you haven't, weren't able to see any of my Facebook Lives, you can go to my YouTube channel, Stamper's Delight, all one word, okay? I know there's other Stamper Delights out there, but they are not all one word. I own that domain. And just type that in, and you'll get to my YouTube channel. So this is one. Oh, gosh, this is gorgeous. <gasps> gorgeous, gorgeous paper. This is going to go great with this set, too. Can you see that for like baby uh, wedding cards or shower cards? I have a couple of those to do. And this is another one with the flower print. Different color. Beautiful. This would be great for scrapbooking. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm going to be busy. And it's like a, it's not shimmery, but it looks almost shimmery. It's like a foil. Oh, my gosh. I really don't want to work today. Oh, look at this paper. Oh, my God. Stampin' Up, you've outdone yourself with this catalog. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, got to get some more of this paper. Definitely. Oh, that's like a marble. Wow. Okay, so that's the beautiful promenade and all its little goodies. I put these in order. Of course, I'm not putting them back in order, but... Okay, so this one is another one of my favorites. Time for Tea. Time for Tea has matching framelits. Spot of Tea. Uh, Frankie, if you're out there, Frankie's from the UK, it's a spot of tea, dear, for you and your mom. Okay, so we have that stamp set. And with that, we have... Memories and More cards, and I am doing a Memories and More class on the 25th, which should be pretty cool. It's a product class, and we're going to take one of the Memories and More kits and make cards with the new um, envelopes, and now I'm getting, I'm getting buried here, people. Okay, so we'll open that. So we're going to um, make cards, and I'm going to show you how the, these are not just for scrapbooking, obviously. Um, we're going to make um, seven different cards, and then the girls are going to go home with their um, products and be able to make up to 43, I think it is, more cards. So if you're interested in that class, just let me know. So I'm not going to open all these. I'll just open some of them because of time. Okay, so here we have the different little cards, and these are great. Obviously for scrapbooking, but they make such great cards. And not only that, they are so quick and easy to do, but come out so elegant. And these are going to be really elegant. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to play with them. Okay, let's see what we have here. Uh, and we have some sticker sheets in here. Some foil. Can you see that? Wow. Wow. Okay, so that is the Memories and More Tea Room. There's also some a tin that I didn't get yet, and we'll be doing a class on that, making 3x3 three three cards. More into that later. And here's the paper that goes with it, the Designer Series paper. So that's one, one side. Let's 
the other side. Now this is a little bit thinner than our regular designer series paper, which is nice because they gave you more sheets of it. Okay. And I'm just going to flip through these real quick so that you can see all the designs up close. Oh my gosh, that's a beautiful one. Anything with flowers I love. I know, maybe it's because of my name, Rose. <laughs> I don't know, but I love flowers. Okay. There we go. And then we have the rest of them. Same same ones. Now these are, again, these are a little thinner. I'm just looking to see. Yeah, there's 24 sheets in here. Big pack. Big pack. Lots to do. Put that back over there. Okay, and the last bundle that I have to show you. Oh, I'm sorry. And we have, with the tea room, we also have matching ribbon. So we have this one. Let me just... I would pick it up with my nails, but I just got those done. Look at this ribbon. Can you see that? Beautiful. It's got the copper edging, and it's also got... I'm going to see if it tells me the colors on here because I haven't really had time to look at everything. This is the white. Isn't that great? Beautiful. So I'm going to have some fun with that. So we're going to get into the, um, the embellishments next. As soon as I'm done with... Oh, this is great. This is great. Okay. So I was in the dollar store. You know how we love our dollar store. So this is the Tropical Chick, or Cheek, or Chic, however you want to say it, Chic. And this also comes with the Tropical Thin Dyes. So this is another bundle. And then we have the Tropical Escape paper. And we'll go through a couple of those. Look at that. Oh my goodness, this is so cool. So much fun. So I was in the dollar store, and I put a uh, you know table little uh, dollar tablecloths over my tables when the girls are stamping, and I usually like to have a theme, okay. And the dollar store has, at least mine does. You know how I love my Dollar Tree girls. They have a bunch of um, summer ones, and they have one that actually looks just like this. And they also have, so again, this is the tropical one. Okay. They also have ones that look like are under the sea. Check this out. Now, I'm not showing you under the sea because we already had that. But that looks just like under the sea. Is that cool or what? So, of course, I bought these for my next class to cover the tables with. I thought this was so great. And then, again, they have ones that match. The tropical cheek okay and this is also in the paper share so those are the stamp set uh, sweets and bundles then we're gonna be doing Christmas in July and here's two new Christmas sets that are in a catalog so the first one is mistletoe season and the next one in the catalog is stylish Christmas great, great new set, new uh, holiday ones. I know we don't want to think about Christmas. And we also have some new designer series paper with that. Okay, so here is the designer series paper with that, and that's also in the paper share, by the way. So let's see what we got here. My fingers aren't working. Oh, wow. And, you know, it is Christmas paper, but you don't have to use it for Christmas. There are some pieces on here obviously not that one but like that one that you could use for every day this one that could be every day this one definitely could be for every day if you like plaid oh my goodness this is so cool yes Christmas in July look for that class that'll be coming up soon lots of plaids I like the plaids always like the plaids Oh, look at the little deer. <laughs> and we're back to the same one. Okay. So I believe there is 
12 sheets in here, six designs, two of each. And let's see what else. Oh my goodness. Let's see what time we got here. Oh yeah, we're good. Okay. So if anybody noticed in the new catalog, we have new glimmer paper. The difference in the glimmer paper is we have, let's see, rose, a rose color. We have silver. Oh, look, my nails match. We have sparkly. Oh, I love anything that says sparkle. And we have gold. Okay. The difference with the new glimmer paper, and I'm going to use the rose because it'll show up better, is it's thinner. Now, if you remember, when we the older glimmer paper, when we went it through the big shot, it was thicker. This is thinner, so it's a little easier going through the um, big shot. Plus, look at this. No glitter on your hands. Hi, Karen. Good morning. Uh, so that was a big thing because we had glitter all over the place when we did that. Morning, Pat. So this, look, I'm rubbing it. I'm rubbing it and no glitter. I love glitter on my nails. I just don't want it all over my body. Well, maybe I do sometimes. I don't know. <laughs> anyway, so this is the new glimmer, glimmer paper. And I love the rose color. That is going to go so nice with, are you ready? Oh, yeah. I see cards in the making. Okay, so those are the glimmer papers. Now, um, I just have these aside because I want to mention these are the other papers that are in the paper share, but we you know, obviously already went over those. Okay, so I'm not going over them again. Okay, now for the other goodies. Let's see what embellishments we have. Haha, <laughs> red rhinestones. Yes, yes, whoop, yes. And we have some, uh, the basic adhesive back uh, sequins. We had those in the occasion catalog. These are a little bit different color. Oh, let's open it and see the colors. I will put these in my cases later. I put everything in our little, I buy the extra cases like this, which you can buy, and I keep all my embellishments in those. So these are real subtle ones. And again, they're like a hologram. I don't know if you can see that. And there's like a peachy color. I'm not sure of all the names yet. These will go nice for the baby cards. They'll also go nice for all the, um, the like the tea room. And I love the fact that they're um, adhesive backings. Anything that's adhesive backings is good for me. We have some more, or some new uh, glitter enamel dots. Great colors there which are, oh, look, that matches my nails, too, um, which are also adhesive backgrounds. Hi, Diana. How are you? Don't forget to share my video, ladies, and I'll tell you why. It's coming up shortly. Okay, so these are some new glimmer dots. I like those. And these are the new uh, metallic pearls. Now, there's gold and silver, if you can see these. And if you notice, a couple of them are a little jumbled. Sometimes they come like that. They come off the paper. No worries. I already called Stampin' Up! on that. Yay, whoop, yay Stampin' Up! I already took care of it. That's why I work for a company I love. Okay, so those are the metallic ones. Let's see what else we have here. Uh, we have some new brads. So if you could see those, look at the colors. Aren't they great? Oh my gosh. Loving those. Missing the brads. And then we have some other, what are those called anyway? Basic brads. <laughs> like I said, I don't know all the names. And then these are metallic brads. Ooh, nice and shiny. And this, the copper ones are going to go nice with the copper tin that goes to the tea room. And then we got some baker's twine. The baker's twine is entwined with some silver. So that's a nice and glittery. Okay, so we got the white and the silver. We have the pool party in the silver. And then we have the petal pink. That's nice. All right. We have, I'm going to save that. We have some ribbon. 
let's do the ribbons. I'm saving one thing for last. Okay, so we have, uh, I didn't buy all the ribbon yet. I bought this one. This is the red um, cotton ribbon. So let's open that one. And let's see how that one works. Because sometimes the ribbon's a little um, stiff. It's not pliable. Oh, wow. This is great. Nice and thin. Not too thin, but nice and pliable. Okay, so that's going to be nice for the Christmas cards. I'm going to do a couple of Christmas cards over the weekend. Um, not that I want Christmas. I would like to enjoy my summer. When it gets here, we had it in February, and now it's uh, cold again, right? This ribbon is... The mini striped ribbon, and we have a uh, poppy parade. We have, you notice I'm reading them because I don't remember all the names, Bermuda Bay. We have, huh, I'm going to love this one, I can already tell, Gorgeous Grape. So let's open the Gorgeous Grape. Come on. Again, great ribbon. Nice and pliable, so you can tie a nice bow with no problem. Great, huh? Okay, that's that ribbon. Ah, this ribbon is, sorry, I'm reaching over to my table now. This is the in colors from last year, which are still available. And this is ruffled ribbon. This is beautiful. Now, I'm only going to open one because of time. And I'm just going to open. I always tend to go for the berry burst. Who else loves the berry burst? Let's see what that's like. Oh, yeah. Again, nice ribbon. You see that? Oh, it's got like a little shimmer to it, actually. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see. Tying that in a bow. This is how I tell if it's real pliable, and I'm going to like it. Yep. Going to like it. My bow isn't really great, but you get you get the idea. So that is our Berry Burst um, Ruffled Ribbon. It's actually called Mini Ruffle, and you got that in the Tranquil Tide. You got it in the Fresh Fig. You got it in the Lemon Lime Twist, and you have it in Powder Pink. So those are some new ribbons. And then I think we're getting to the end. Oh, one more thing and then, oh, no, two more things. Okay, so this is the um, textured weave. I only got the one because I wanted to try it out, see if I liked it, and then tell you if I liked it. And this piece came off. I'm not worried about that. But Stamp It Up already took care of it for me. That's another great ribbon. And look, it's got like a white edge to it. Granny apple green. So this is really nice. And again, you can tie it in a bow. Um, we'll be playing around with that this week. End. Okay. So that's that ribbon. And then here's something I'm really excited about. The new in color embossing powders. Call Me Clover, Pineapple Punch, Blueberry Bushel, this is, this, I love this one, I like them all, who am I kidding, Grapefruit Grove, and we have uh, Lovely Lipstick, so we have new embossing powders, ta-da, so those are all the new things I got, with the exception of something that I got extra, and these are our chamois. Loving the chamois, and I'll show you the one I've been using because I was able to order an early one. The chamois, when you open them up, okay, they have a wet consistency, damp. All you need to do is put some water on them, and when you do that, when you have ink on your stamp, you just ink it off. Now, it's going to um, stain your chamois, but it doesn't stop it from working, okay? So... Don't worry about if it's stained. All you're going to do when you need to is run it under tap water, squeeze it out, and reuse it. I put it in one of the small cases. Works perfect. Okay? 
what I did was I got two more so that when the girls come to my class, I usually have two tables going. Okay, I wanted them to be able to use them. You still need the stamp and scrub when you want to do a good cleaning. Um, but these work great for just, you know, a quick, easy clean. It does clean them great. So um, I wanted you to see those. Now, before I go back, I'm just re reading my notes. Check back with me at 7 o'clock, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Sunday so you can see what I've done with these. Um, don't forget to look in the catalog on page 215 and 213 for some... Uh, guides that Stampin' Up! gives you. 215 is the Big Shot Sandwich Guide, which tells you what to use with what when you're using the framelits. And for any questions about adhesives, look to page 213. I did want to mention that. So, that's my unboxing of my newer products. Check back with me Sunday for some stamping and some samples. And excuse me... <coughs> Got a little bit of a cold, so I had to cough. Actually, let me grab a cup of coffee. Didn't mean to sip in your ear. So, this is all the new product I ordered. Again, I'm going to be back on Sunday, 7 p.m. So, share my video. Go to stampersdelight.com. That will give you all the information. If you don't have a demonstrator, you need a demonstrator, or you want to join my team, and I can tell you why. Because we're so much fun. We're awesome. <clears throat> Again, I'm sorry about that. Um, if you can't catch me live on Friday mornings, you can always check back on Facebook. Or you can go to YouTube, Stampers Delight, all one word. I transfer them to um, YouTube. So now for the giveaway. Even though you may be watching this later, you can still share the video and leave comments. I am going to pick on Sunday evening from this video <clears throat> whether you do it now or you do it later but by Sunday anybody that has shared my video and once you share it you have to type in shared okay because I can see if you've shared it or not uh, I want I would like you to share that one lucky winner is going to win a simply chamois yay you want a simply chamois for free share this video share it now if not, share it later, but share the video on Facebook, and one lucky winner will... Thank you, Maureen. Thanks for sharing. You're in the drawing. Um, one lucky winner will win this, okay? So I hope you enjoyed the unboxing of my newest products. Um, oh, one, one thing I wanted to show you before I let you go. This is really cool. Another uh, Dollar Tree find. Let me show you in the catalog real quick. So this is on my next list, and this is our, I get excited when I get to the dollar store and find stuff that goes with Stampin' Up. So let me just show you this. These are um, our embossing folders, and the new one is called Tuft. Let me show you. If you can see that, let's say, right there. It's like, see that? It's called Tuft. Look what I found in the dollar store, and of course I had to buy it. Don't know what I'm going to do with it yet. Matches our embossing folder. The dollar store is great. It goes so well with Stampin' Up. So don't forget to check it out and see what you can use at the Dollar Tree with your Stampin' Up products. Okay. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Have a great weekend. And I'll see you back here Sunday night at 7 p.m. Bye. Happy Stampin' Stampers.